Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to my afternoon news report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. Bomb Squad police work to gather evidence after Rochester standoff. A man was taken into custody overnight after an hours-long standoff at a mobile home park in Rochester. The standoff began after 3 p.m. Thursday at the Amazon Park in Rochester. Ryan, 30, was taken into custody around midnight. He is charged with five counts of simple assault, criminal mischief, and false imprisonment. Phillips said that as the victim was on the phone with police, he kept Ryan at bay. That encounter led to a standoff which forced the evacuation of the park. Lee's had to hold his three-month-old grandson while walking down the street during the evacuation. In a nearby mobile home, Matthew Gray looked out of his home about 4.30 p.m. only to be told to get back inside. The standoff finally ended when police forced their way inside the mobile home home. Ryan was taken to Maine Medical Center for treatment, but police said he was not injured by them. After the evacuation, the state police bomb swept area to make sure it was safe for residents to return home. The squad members returned to the scene find it Friday, armed with a search warrant as they and Rochester police continue to gather evidence. It's not known when Ryan will be arraigned. And that did it for my afternoon news report right here on the Riley King Network. I hope you all have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you back here later on today for another news report and for the Riley King newscast. Goodbye, everyone.